So here at the Web Summit, we have Unity, a Swedish car, which looks like a smart, but it's electric, 300 kilometers range, and it's going to be introduced December the 7th and on the market on 2019, they say. Let's find out the specs. So what do you say? Is this smart 3.0? No, this is a complete different car. It is actually two people after another, so it's going to be Finn. And 450 kilometers, 75 kilowatt hour, 300 kilometers range, um, carbon, and it will charge 80% in 15 minutes. So it has a fast charger in there. Let's find out about the specs. So, Pavo, what do you do inside Unity? So I'm the, the battery guy at Unity. I'm responsible for the battery pack. Okay, what's, what, kind of, uh, what kind of batteries can we expect in there? We'll probably go with uh, cylindrical cells. Uh, developed in 18650 uh, from uh, Panasonic? Uh, I think we're gonna go for the 21700 actually uh -huh. and prepare for the future. Yeah. Uh, the one in which uh, was developed together with Tesla. Yeah, yeah. Uh, but as for supplier we're looking into several different. Okay. So you don't know if you're gonna use Samsung or Panasonic or uh, Tesla maybe or something like that. That's not decided yet so we're in that phase. How big will the battery be? The battery pack will be have 22 kilowatt hours and you, part of it is uh, flexible, right? You can take out of the car. Why is that? Exactly. So uh, we also have a portable battery. And the reason is that we see that a lot of our customers will not have the possibility to charge at their uh, home. So in order to um, help them, uh, they can be charging at the work or another facility. With a normal 220 volts. And that's a small battery. How big is that battery? So that will be 1.5 kilowatt or something like that. You can drive how much with that? About 30 kilometers. Is it that efficient? 1.5 kilowatt hours, 30 kilometers? That is really, that is like five times more than a Nissan Leaf. <laughs> That's uh, what we're aiming for. I mean, the weight is really, really low on the car. Yeah. The aerodynamics is custom made to, uh, to use as little energy as possible and fit these two people in tandem. Uh, so we have even less uh, wind drag. Yeah. So yeah. Um, so that, and it will be have a fast charger. Will you what, which fast charger will you support? We are looking into different fast charger solutions uh, depending on uh, w what market. So we'll see. Okay, thank you. So here we have Marcelo, who is the developer, the designer. So is this a smart um, Marcelo? I think it's more than a smart. <laughs> you have a smart yourself, right? I do. I do. Uh, so you like the machine, but what is different about uh, this uh, this Unity machine and the smart? Uh, the first thing uh, is that the the whole user experience of the car uh, is so much better. Uh, we took the advantage to um, to innovate uh, instead of staying uh, stuck to the old conventional uh, automotive. Uh, yeah. The old conventional that we're sitting next to each other, now we're sitting behind each other, so the car is a lot thinner. So if, you're, uh, if, you're, if you have a family, you can uh, purchase the, the four-seater as a second family car. It will come uh, after a long time after. But at first, you say we've innovated because we put people behind each other. Okay, what's the other innovation in terms of design? The innovation is that it is a, a small, uh, lightweight el electric vehicle. And uh, did you know that 1.2 persons is the number that most of the, 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 the trips uh, cars have? So the second seat is actually an occasional seat. So if you want to take someone uh, for a spin or to take someone uh, the, to a ride, you do have the second seat. But this is a car that's mostly for you. For one person uh, in there. What else is in terms of uh, how much luggage do you have or what kind of other innovations have you, uh, have you inc included? Uh, the boot space, although it's, it, this is a small car, the boot space is uh, good for two cabin trolleys uh, at least. So it is very good for the size of the car. That it what material did you use? Uh, carbon fiber mostly, uh, the chassis as well as the, um, as well as the panels. So it's a very lightweight car. Thank you. Gabriele, when can we see this car in real action for the first time? All right, so December 7th this year, we're going to have a launch event at our new production facility in South of Sweden, that's Kona. Yep. And then you're going to get to see it 
experience uh, for the first time. And then uh, we can expect it on the roads by 2019. So. Okay, what's the price going to be? It's going to be 20,000 euros. Uh, for and I can basically model. already uh, do a pre, uh, pre-buying? pre Yeah, you can already pre-order it uh, on our website, unity.r slash invest. And yeah. then you can either uh, yeah, pre-order it straight there. Okay. And um, soon enough we'll have a configurator. Yeah, how, much, uh, how many people in the company? Uh, right now we're about 45 employees and then we have some uh, interns and people helping out, yeah. volunteers. Who started the company? Uh, Lewis Horn is our founder, so uh, he started the company and this is all based on his idea. And, then, uh, and he's Swedish? No, he's from Australia actually. He uh-huh. came to learn uh, to study and then fell in love with Sweden. Okay, <laughs> and he basically has designed car before? Uh, no, he has not. Social networks, right? So he is, uh, he's done all sorts of, uh, of things, entrepreneurial things and so on, and worked a lot with the Lund University. And then, uh, yeah, this whole company is actually founded from a research project where we looked at transportation and all these okay. things. Who so, funded the company? So it is Lewis who fu- fu- sorry, funded. Who, who founded? Who gave who the money to start the company? Well, so it's founded by Lewis, but then with uh, the funds we've taken in, we've done a lot of uh, equity crowdfunding. We have two big campaigns, one uh, last year and one this year, and before that just some private investors and angel investors. Uh, how much money totally invested at the moment? Uh, not sure exactly how much has been invested But 10 million, moment. 20, 100? Uh, Euro or crowns. Euro? So, uh, oh, you're yeah. So more like uh, 3 million Euro maybe? Okay, so it's a very modest startup. And it's going to come to the market on December the 5th. The Swedes are coming with an electric car.